Okay, let's see if we can do this for you. All right, I've just set up this type right here. Here is a baseline shift, and uh, I'm going to show you how to do a baseline shift on one of the letters. Um, you'll need to go to the characters uh, menu, which you can find in a half a dozen different places. But the main thing, I keep it over here on the on my left. Uh, on my right menus over here like this. Now you may or may not have that over there. If you don't have that over there, you can go under um, under view and you should, uh, under, excuse me, under window and you should be able to find it in here under type and tables, character, and it'll pop up like that. Um, and uh, so if you can find the character, Command T, by the way, will bring up the character menu if you don't have it over here already. Um, if it doesn't have it open already, you'll want, if it just comes up like this, you will want to click on this little menu at the top corner and say Show Options, and that'll bring you down here. And that takes you to right here, which is your baseline shift tool. So let's say I want to just take this S in baseline and shift it upward. I can go right over here in this tool and click there and I can use my arrow tool on the keypad and I can just go up with that S as high as I want to or I can run it down as low as I want to and that will give you a baseline shift and you know you can even do while you're in this menu you can even reduce the size of that font anyway let me know if that kind of helps you get the control you're after here you go.